and I'm joined today. I'm jo uh, so good morning, everybody. Yeah, my name is Nick Wright. I'm one of the uh, the, the product managers at Westcon. Uh, I'm joined today by Mikhail Storbeck uh, of Blue Jeans. So, um, just a bit of a housekeeping. So, the presentation will be recorded and it will be shared to you after the session today. Uh, that's the presentation uh, as the slide deck and the recording. Um, please feel free to ask any questions as we progress through the slides uh, using the chat feature uh, within the window pane. Uh, and we will we will answer these questions at the end of the session. Um, so in terms of the agenda, I'm just going to run through a short number of slides on what the opportunity is and how Westcom can help. I'll then hand you over to Mikhail, who will talk to you in a lot more detail about the Blue Jeans and Polycom interoperability, as well as provide a bit of an insight into the, the Blue Jeans roadmap um, on Microsoft Teams, which is, I think, very interesting for all of us to hear. That's the next slide, please, Mikhail. So just a bit of context as to what the opportunity with Polycom and Blue Jeans is. I, I thought it it's important just to reiterate that the world of video collaboration is changing. Traditionally, video conferencing has been seen as a meter room solution for mid to large enterprises who typically had the budgets for capital investment. However, as the modern workplace is evolving, businesses are now looking at ways to enable collaboration to save time, improve productivity and enhance the customer experience. And this is driving this shift from on premise to video as a service cloud based solutions. Also, there was a growing trend within organizations to, to look to turn unproductive meeting spaces into collaboration areas. Uh, and this is seeing a high demand in smaller huddle room solutions um, from vendors such as Polycom. Uh, so next slide, please, Mikhail. So, so what are the advantages of on-premise versus a video as a service uh, cloud-based solution? Well, it might, may, may sound, sound obvious, but I think it's worth just reiterating what those benefits are. So, so cloud tends to be cheaper uh, than on-prem solutions, as there's no, no upfront investment due to cloud being an OPEX model for, for investment. There's no hidden infrastructure costs, and there's no dedicated resource required to manage video meeting rooms. Cloud solutions are typically easy to use, uh, and this helps to improve user adoption and provides a quicker ROI. Cloud enables collaboration with anyone, anywhere, and from any device. And for me, this is one of the key benefits of video as a service. So this moves video out of the meeting room uh, into any employee, any employee or worker across the organization. And cloud solutions uh, generally provide similar functionality and features to on-prem solutions. So there should be no feature degradation for an on-prem customer to uh, migrate into a video as a service solution with BlueJeans. And lastly, cloud solutions are typically vendor uh, endpoint agnostic, and this can help extend the uh, life of the existing endpoint and help the customer sweat their, their on-prem asset. Uh, so next slide, please, Mikhail. So uh, according to research by various analysts, such as the IDC worldwide, um, cloud would drive more than 90% of our customers' technology spend by 2019. So if we do not embrace this change, then we risk customer stickiness with the install base, as well as limiting new opportunities with customers. Um, and there is a myriad of choice when it comes to collaboration solutions. So it's important for us to move the conversation uh, outside of the meeting room and change the conversation to how many meeting rooms do you have, Mr. Customer, um, to more of a business issues led conversation. Uh, and adopting this consultative approach to selling uh, helps businesses to maximize the benefits of collaboration throughout their organization and not just restricting those benefits in the meeting room. So if we're able to offer customers a, a choice of deployment options, we tend to realize uh, higher margin opportunities uh, and those opportunities tend to be a recurring revenue um, for us. Um, so, so when sending cloud, that's where the recurring revenue comes in. So this also improves customer stickiness as well as incre increasing the endpoint uh, attach opportunity, which again is opening the door for Polycom into this um, space. So uh, next slide, please, Mikhail. So why Polycom and BlueJeans? Well, a few months ago, uh, Polycom and BlueJeans announced a strategic partnership which goes beyond simply a meeting the channel alliance. As you'll hear from Mikhail, there is no inter interoperability between the two solutions. Uh, but until recently, uh, Polycom and BlueJeans would have been considered competitors. However, the new partnership is recognition by Polycom that video as a service is a high growth industry with BlueJeans being the market leader in this space. So, so aligning to video as, as a service will help Polycom increase attach opportunities uh, of endpoints in the meeting room space. And for BlueJeans, this partnership brings poly a Polycom channel and install base that is ready for transition to video as a service. 
So this is an exciting opportunity for partners as it provides higher margin opportunities uh, and those opportunities are recurring revenue. So, so for blue jeans, partners can typically expect to retain around 20% um, gross margin and that, that can be increased by deal registering opportunities, which then provide an additional 5% discount for that. So, so by moving focus from a CapEx to OpEx investment model, um, BlueJeans should enable customers to free up capital expenditure budgets um, to invest in more polycom meeting room solutions. So in combination with BlueJeans any device approach to meetings, this enables customers to expand the video footprint within the organization. Furthermore, the consistent BlueJeans user interface will, will be available on any device, uh, including the polycom touch control. So this enhances the user experience, drives adoption, and builds a really strong ROI with your customers. Um, so last slide, thank you. So, so how can Westcon help you as a distributor? Well, we're a pandemic distributor for both vendors, which means we, we, which means we can support your multinational customer opportunities. We also have Polycom and BlueJeans set up in our demo room facilities, which means we can help you support, um, support you with reseller training needs and end user demos. We'll also be very shortly launching a, a new Polycom Attached promotion, which provides 10% additional discount when selling Polycom meeting room solutions uh, in conjunction with BlueJeans. So it's that promotion should be launched this week. So look out for that from your account manager. Um, also, Westcon is a uh, Polycom Services certified um, distributor, which means we, you can further enhance your margin opportunities by attaching Westcon Gold Seal maintenance instead of Polycom Premier maintenance. And that should make you an additional 10 to 15 percent margin um, just by using Westcon certified gold seal support. So although video is the main driver behind the Polycom and uh, BlueJeans solution, um, the importance of audio quality should not be overlooked. Uh, and this is especially important for remote workers and road warriors who are likely to join BlueJeans meetings from a tablet, mobile phone or a laptop. And these types of users would typically join meetings from a noisy or open environment. So therefore, it would always be recommended to build in headsets into the overall solution opportunity. Again, Westcon is, a, is a, um, a distributor for the three leading headset brands in the UK, that's Plantronic, Sennheiser and Jabra. So, so our experience and knowledge of, of this can help you, rec you recommend the right headset for your customer based on worker profile and, and budget. We also have a, a dedicated renewals team to help manage the Blue Gym subscription licensing. Uh, so this takes away the complexity that you may have within your own organization in managing a renewals based uh, vendor. And, and lastly, we have a very talented in-house marketing team who can assist, uh, assist you in building out end user campaigns to help drive leads uh, and, and, and demand opportunities within not only your install base, but also with net new customers. And we will very shortly be launching a, a new Polycom uh, BlueJeans campaign to help further that, that um, demand gen. So again, look out for that over the coming weeks uh, and your account manager will be able to give you more details on that. So again, if you've got any questions, please feel free to ask them in the chat room. But I'll, I'll now hand you over to Mikhail, who will talk to you about the, uh, the opportunity in a bit more detail. Thank you. Thank you very much, Nick. And uh, hello, everyone. Nice to see that we have a lot of participants on, on this webinar. So for today, the, the plan of, of today was really to talk about BlueJeans and, uh, and Polycom, how we work together and, and what the alliance that we announced in November last year was uh, is really about. But I do think that we have a few uh, participants on the call today that haven't heard about BlueJeans before. And, uh, and uh, therefore, I wanted to run through just a few slides to give you a very short um, summary of, of BlueJeans, who we are and, and what, what we do. So to start things off, uh, of course, BlueJeans is a video as a service platform. Um, we're the biggest in the industry in, in terms of video as a service providers. And, and really what we offer is uh, the, the video meetings platform for, for modern work. Um, what that means is that we, we offer a solution where you can join from whatever device you want to use uh, in a very simple manner. Uh, basically, as you see on the slide, it's a it's one click join flow, uh, regardless if you're joining from your laptop, your mobile, or from a proper room system into, into a video meeting. Um, so simplicity is key, both from the end user perspective, but also from a, an IT management perspective. Uh, we wanna make sure that the, that the service is really easy to run and easy to deploy and manage. Uh, so I'll talk a bit about that as well. Secondly, of course, uh, BlueJeans is immersive. Um, a, a very intuitive uh, user interface is key for us, and, and we do include all the features and functions you would uh, require from a both a video and a, a web compressing solution. And of course, security is key for us as well. Um, 
especially here in Europe, where we have a lot of countries that are, are very keen on, on their security, we, we can provide uh, a high grade of security, for example, SOC 2 compliancy, which is, is not that common uh, amongst cloud providers. So we're proud to be to be able to, to be compliant uh, from SOC 2 perspective. And happy to give you a, a proper white paper on security as well, if, if that's something that's important. If we look at BlueJeans and, and what we actually offer into the marketplace, there's um, there's four different products that we have um, currently available. So I just wanted to run through this with, with you guys to give you the background of what, what we actually offer. So first of all, uh, our bread and butter product is called BlueJeans Meetings. That basically means that you can, as a BlueJeans meeting moderator, you can organize video meetings with anybody in the world uh, with up to 100 participants joining from whatever device they want to join into a video meeting. So we include room systems, H323 or SIP systems. We include laptops and mobiles to be able to join these sessions and everybody on HD quality as long as the bandwidth actually covers covers that need. Um, however, we also see that that the sort of day-to-day -day interactive meetings um, isn't the only use case that our enterprise customers have. There's a lot of uh, customers who want to do larger events. So for that specific need, we've also launched something called BlueJeans Events. And to explain that very shortly, it's it's all about uh, combining the, the multi-point video meeting functionality that we have in the meetings platform with streaming capabilities uh, that we do on, on the events platform. So you can still have up to 100 uh, presenters that show both uh, both content and share their video, uh, video feed, but you can have up to 15,000 attendees watching a, a stream of that specific uh, multi-point video session. So it really takes that, that traditional webinar and makes it interactive with multi-point video. Um, and the good thing is that you can even, even as an attendee, raise your hand and, and that will then um, uh, trigger a, a question back to the moderator who can promote you into presenter mode, mode which gives you the, the ability to actually act, ask questions during the, the sessions live and show your own video and, and content as well. Um, a third product that we have uh, recently launched is called Ludius Rooms. Um, so if we look at the use cases that people might have within a larger enterprise, meetings covers the day-to-day -day sort of uh, conversations that you would need to have on, on, on video. Um, events is really for your large webinar needs. And then when it comes to the, the, the facilities or the meeting, meeting rooms that people have in their organizations, we have software that can actually turn any meeting space, any, any meeting room into an intelligent meeting room, uh, making it really simple to use that, that uh, those endpoints that are, are, are physically installed in that room. So what we sell is software and, and our BlueJeans Rooms license is software to make either a PC-based room or a codec-based room like a Polycom or Cisco room, uh, very simple to use with one click to join functionality uh, as we do have on both laptops and, and mobiles alike. And finally, um, we also offer uh, streaming capabilities. So this actually, I wouldn't call a product, it's, it's more, of a, more of a feature that's included both in the meetings and events platform. Uh, but in essence, because of the fact that Facebook is one of our largest customers globally, we have a, a direct integration into Facebook Live and Facebook Workplace. If you do do meetings over BlueJeans, you have a, a one uh, click button within the interface to actually stream those sessions directly live over, over Facebook, uh, either Facebook Live or, or Workplace. So that's a great add to those customers that really have, um, have, have started using Facebook also in, a, in an enterprise environment. So that's a, a brief capture of, of what we actually do and what we sell to our customers. And um, next, so I, I was planning on talking about what has made BlueJeans um, successful. So really to give you just a, a few of the cornerstones why, why we have, have been successful over the last, uh, well, six or seven years, um, founded in 2009 and actually launching the, the first product in 2011. And the, the first starting point was really that we offer um, the best interoperability in the, in the industry. And with inter interop, we mean that you can actually join a Bluegin session from any device, as I've said many times before. So, so you see here these black dots uh, on the screen, they actually uh, show different ways of how you can join a Bluegin session. So starting with Polycom, of course, being the the topic of today, um, or any other SIP or HD23 uh, provider that, that has room systems, they can all join, join BlueJeans sessions. But you can also join a BlueJeans meeting from your laptop. So either using the BlueJeans application and installing that, 
or using WebRTC, where we actually have, uh, we're supporting all the browsers in the market, so you can join a Bluegen session without any plugins or any installations at all. And of course, that's really important in, in the scenario where you, you're inviting external people into your meeting so that they don't have to, as, as non Bluegen customers, go and install anything that isn't standardized in their, in, their, in their IT environment. So they can really join from any device as long as they have a browser running on their computer. And thirdly, in the mobile world, uh, looking at your, your smartphones and your, your iPads or, or Android tablets for that matter, we do support both iOS and Android as, as operating systems. So you can join from any mobile device that you happen to have um, into a Bluetooth session. But on top of that, we also support other video clients that you might have running on your computer. So Skype for Business being one of the most common ones. Um, or Cisco Jabber, for that matter, or other clients that you might have on your on your on your laptop. So the the whole idea is that you don't have to learn a new way of joining a video session. You can use the the platform that you're used to and the user interface that you're used to, and can still join video meetings uh, with ease. Another important thing for Bluejeans to have have that has made us successful is that we support uh, or we offer. Um, a good insight into how the solution is working. So considering that we are a cloud provider and, and people just basically buy logins and use us over the internet, it's really important that both IT uh, management and, and admin personnel within the customer have a good view of how the service is running within their organization and how people are using it and if they're happy or not. So we have something called uh, BlueJeans Command Center, which gives very detailed reporting on both key users, how people join, from what type of devices they join, and, and also whether people are happy with the meeting. So after each Bluetooth session, you'll receive a, a feedback questionnaire, just a, a very simple click uh, of how happy you were with the meeting. And if there are any issues, um, those negative feedbacks we always um, proactively work on to, to solve that issue for our customers. And being a cloud provider, that also solves the, that, that issue for the rest of those 7,000 enterprise customers that we have been um, currently using Bluejeans. On top of that, we can also offer return on uh, investment calculator directly in this tool and also a management tool for any Bluejeans rooms that you have deployed within your organization. So it gives you a really great tool in, in managing the whole solution um, company-wide. And finally, I would say one of the most important things for, for us um, uh, as, as a unique selling point is that we can offer the same user interface regardless of the use case or the device that you're joining a, a, a Bluetooth session. So whether you're on, on your laptop or on a tablet or on your phone, for example, or even joining from a room system, you have the same user interface uh, and the same look and feel joining those sessions in all of these different use cases. And that's something that enterprises really have, have loved and, and, and why they are choosing Bluetooth uh, instead of other, other solutions out there. And this really ties well into what we're doing with Polycom, which is the, the topic of today, uh, and how the, the alliance of, of Polycom in, in practice will, will work moving forward. So jumping into that Polycom um, uh, announcement that we did in, in November, what it really means is that we technically already had a solution for a couple of years where we've integrated the Polycom room systems into the, the Bluetooth solution. But now uh, this fall, also Polycom um, have, have certified their own endpoints on the Bluetooth cloud and, and using Bluetooth relay software, which I'm gonna talk about in a second. And really that integration gives that one click join flow from any Polycom room into uh, the Bluetooth solution. On top of that, of course, we also offer uh, other go-to-market ac activities that we do where we have a line. So, so sales and channel alignment, of course, that's part of why we're here today is talking to the Westcon resellers that both sell, sell both Polycom and Bluetooth and make sure that, that you're aligned in, in terms of how you can sell these two different products together. Uh, we are co-developing marketing materials and, and we're also aligning our support organizations so that we can support um, the, the Polycom endpoints and Polycom has knowledge about blue jeans in their own support organization. So it is about the strategic alignment and, and we are getting closer um, um, every day, I would say, and, and especially since last, last February when Polycom decided not to um, pursue their own cloud solutions, blue jeans and Polycom's relationship has, has really um, become much, much closer and we're working much more together all over Europe, really. 
So in terms of the technical solution behind uh, this integration, uh, it's all about a software, a software called BlueGIS Relay that uh, will basically connect your calendar um, into your room systems. So you can go in and book a BlueGIS meeting directly in Outlook or Gmail, and that will automatically push that meeting information to that Polycom unit that you have in your meeting rooms. Uh, so you get a list of those meetings that you have, have booked for that specific room. And when you walk into that Polycom room, you just hit the button and you're in into that session. So what Polycom has done is that they've certified these uh, different devices that you see on the screen. So we've got the debut, the group series, and even Trio uh, works on the BlueJeans uh, software today um, to, to achieve that one-click join flow from, from Polycom rooms. So what you really need to take from this from a technical standpoint is that that BlueJeans and Polycom works easily together. Um, this is what the user interface looks like once you've actually put in the Relay software um, into your organization and, and push those meetings to that uh, real presence touch, uh, touch screen. So, so once you have the, the meetings populated on that screen, it's just a qu question of hitting the, the, the right meeting on that touch screen and the meeting starts uh, from that meeting room. And of course, the added benefit that BlueJeans can offer is that anybody can then join that session, not from only Polycom rooms, but also from other solutions. So from laptops uh, using WebRTC without, of course, any federations needed, or from mobiles and tablets uh, as well using the BlueJeans app. So you're really opening up that, that investment that you have made in, in high quality video room systems from Polycom to work with anything out there that, that really wants to join your session um, directly from, from whatever device they happen to have. Uh, without going too detailed into what, how this technically works, um, the, the BlueJeans Relay software is, is a software that we install uh, natively within the, um, the network of the customer who wants to use this software. And what it really does is that it's, it's listening for any meeting bookings that you've done uh, on BlueJeans, so either in, in Gmail calendar or in, in Outlook, if you do a, a BlueJeans Blue booking and you choose a specific meeting room as, as a resource, that meeting room will, uh, or that meeting room will then be pushed automatically to the touch panel in that meeting room. So either a real presence touch screen or an Android or iOS tablet that's used as a, a, a control panel for that, that meeting room system. Uh, so that's really what, what that BlueJeans software does, uh, explaining it very, very simply. And I just want to reiterate uh, that, that this software can actually be installed either on Polycom, Polycom's native touchscreen, so the real presence touch uh, touchscreen, or a, on an iPad or Android tablet. And why this is important is that many customers already have Polycom units out there that might be of older version, HD access or similar or um, even new versions that don't have the real touch touchscreen um, available yet. So what we can do is we can make the user interface the same also in those older rooms uh, by just installing, a, installing an iPad or an Android tablet as the touchscreen for that specific um, Polycom endpoint. And of course, another good benefit is that if you do want to have Polycoms in your larger room to get, achieve best audio and video quality, but you might want to invest in a, a lower cost PC based um, room system solution in, in your smaller meeting rooms, we can still achieve the same user interface in all of these rooms and giving the, the same user experience to people regardless of what type of technology they're using in, in these rooms. So that's in essence what the Polycom announcement is about and what technically we can do with Polycom. Another part of the, the presentation today was really to talk about what we do with, with Microsoft and how we work with Microsoft today compared to what we will be offering in the future as well. Um, to start with, it's good to know that BlueJeans has worked with Microsoft ever since our inception. Um, the first product that we brought to market was uh, the ability to join the consumer Skype back then in 2011 with, with room systems um, from Polycom, Cisco and LifeSize, etc. Uh, during the years, we've actually added on a lot of interoperability, as I said, as I said um, earlier on in this presentation. But from a Microsoft perspective, we've always uh, supported all the Microsoft collaborative solutions. So we have supported Link, we do support Skype for Business, and we will support Teams now that, that people are moving from Skype for Business into Teams uh, for the future. So if we look at quickly what we have in place today in terms of the integration with Skype for Business, 
and then go and look at what we will be doing with Teams later on this year. So when we talk about the Microsoft collaborative space, uh, they have a lot of different tools, of course, in, in, their, in their toolkit that really is important. Um, most people today have uh, Skype for Business in use, and of course, that's the most important integration. But we also have calendar, calendar integration to both Outlook and Office 365, and we can support rooms, also even for Surface Hubs as endpoints, joining Bluetooth sessions uh, if needed. So we really cover the, the full Microsoft spe spectrum when it comes to their, their collab collaborative solutions. Um, what we offer today um, in terms of the Skype for Business integration, there's two different ver versions of how you can use Skype for Business when joining Luigi's sessions. Uh, so I'm going to try and explain those two different uh, op options on this, on this slide. So if you look at the right hand side, if you do want to join uh, natively from Skype for Business client, there is that option. So when somebody sends you a Blue Jeans invite, uh, you click the, the, the link in the Blue Jeans invite that opens up the starting screen. And on that starting screen, you can choose other options uh, to connect, and, and you'll get the option to actually choose Skype to connect into, into the meeting. So this will give you the, the, the native Skype client. It will open up that, that normal Skype client, and you can use Skype to join a session um, as you would uh, on, on Skype natively as well. So a good thing there is that you don't have to learn any new tools. You use whatever you're, you're used to today. Uh, the drawbacks really is that, that Skype hasn't been built for video, especially not for multi-point video. So most people use Skype what it, for what it's good for, which is IM and presence, point-to-point uh, -point calling, um, even point-to-point -point video works quite fine. But when you go into multi-point video, that's where there's some, some sort of drawbacks with uh, Skype for Business. So just to compare, um, if you do join a video session from Skype for Business, you're using about four meg to, re to actually send and receive uh, HD quality picture. What we do uh, in, in BlueJeans is about the meg, so a fourth of the connection to, e to reach HD quality uh, audio and video over the BlueJeans platform. So of course, the, lo the more people you have in a meeting, uh, the better the quality will be for all of these, these uh, joining from the same network. Uh, another benefit that we can add on top of, of Skype for Business is the different video layouts. So on Skype for Business, uh, many of you are, are probably familiar that you have that stripe of different pictures. So if you have 10 people joining, they're all next to each other on a, on a long stripe on the screen, instead of actually using the screen full out, uh, util utilizing uh, pictures uh, using the, the full screen. So we can um, have participants join and, and actually choose their own layout to get the optimal view uh, of, of each and every camera that, that's, that's joining that session. The third thing is that we offer more functionality. So for example, recording is something that we offer, which is included in Skype for Business. So, so that also adds to the benefits of using, using BlueJeans as the video platform. So that was joining from Skype natively. And then if we look at the left-hand side, which most, most of our customers actually do use uh, to, to achieve all, all of these benefits that I've just talked about, we can install a BlueJeans plugin on top of the, the actual uh, Skype for Business chat uh, window. So you see that small BlueJeans start video call button on the right-hand side of that chat window. What you can do then is that if, you're, if you are in a, in a meeting internally with people, you're sorry, not, in, not in a meeting, in a chat, and you're, you're sending chat messages to, to each other, just by hitting that start video call button, it will move you into a BlueJeans meeting and it will send a link to everybody on that chat for them to actually join over BlueJeans into that BlueJeans meeting. So you're still using Skype for what it's good for, I am presence, chat, chatting to each other and seeing whether people are at their desk or not. But then when you do want to do a BlueJeans uh, or, or a video meeting, you jump, jump into BlueJeans to, to achieve the benefits that I just spoke about. So those are the two flavors of, of options that we have available today. If you look at, at scheduling um, and scheduling through Microsoft tools, we do offer both an Outlook add-in and Office 365 add-in for, uh, for scheduling needs. Um, what's good to mention on the Office 365 piece is that we're actually natively integrated with Microsoft, meaning that it's not a plugin or an extra installation that people need to do we are already built into Office 365. So the only thing the customers need to do as, is that their Office 365 admin goes into the, the features list and ticks a box that they want to use BlueJeans as the, uh, the video tool, which will add the, uh, the button to actually send out uh, BlueJeans invites directly from, 
the Office 365 calendar without any, any software installations needed at all. So those are things that we have in place today. But if you look at then what's going to happen in the future, then I'll, I'll show you what's going, going to come. So as most of you know, Skype Business is uh, being moved into the, the larger collaborative tool called Microsoft Teams, which will include a lot of different solutions, but also the whole Skype for Business um, functionality that, that, that is there today. Um, this is already ongoing, so Microsoft is currently moving customers over. And, and as far as I understand, the plan is that within three years, most customers would have moved over to, to Microsoft Teams. So, of course, we want to be future proof as well and offer integration into Teams uh, when, when that's happening. So, we're actually launching this this year. Uh, I can't talk about exact dates, but we will have an integration in place uh, later on this, this year. Uh, what it will look like is really a, a, it's a new product for Bluejeans where we will have a gateway from room systems into the Teams environment. So, it's good to distinguish between what we have today, which is our own platform, Bluejeans Meetings and the gateway that actually just connects Polycom or Cisco or life size rooms into Bluejeans Teams using the Teams uh, platform for the, for the, as the video platform for that meeting. So that's one thing that's coming. Another thing, of course, is that we will also, as we do today, have a bot that will launch people directly from a Teams chat into a Bluejeans session, um, similar to, to the current Skype for Business integration, uh, just by writing a command, like in this example here at Bluejeans, and then that will automatically kick off a Bluejeans session directly from, from the Teams uh, chat window. So that's something that's coming later on this year and, and will basically mean that customers who use Bluejeans today will have the same type of, of, um, of um, integration and, and interoperability with, with Teams going forward as, as we have with Skype Business today. Um, so, so really future-proofing our, our own solution in that way. I think that covers both the Polycom um, piece of, of this presentation, as well as the Microsoft piece. And, and really what I wanted to end with is that from a Bluejeans perspective, what we want your customers really to focus on is the business outcome, not the technology supporting it. So they, people shouldn't think about how to get people into meetings. That should be intuitive and simple. Um, and that's our job to make that, that pr product so simple and intuitive that people love using it. And that's the way that they achieve the productivity of, of, of video conferencing that is, is available and, and, and possible today. So with those words, I'll go into any questions that might have popped up during this short presentation. So maybe no, I'll we've ask... got one. Yeah, we've got one question come through, Mikhail. It's, um, what does the Polycom integration and relay software cost and how does the licensing work? Okay, uh, very good question. So the, the actual relay software itself, um, the technical solution behind the Polycom integration doesn't cost anything extra. That's something that is included in the Bluejeans licensing already for any, any Bluejeans customer today or any future Bluejeans customers. Um, in terms of the licensing, uh, I won't go into the details in this call, but uh, I can tell you that we do have three different license types. One is called uh, the named host license, which is really for Customers who can identify which which users will be using Bluejeans, they'll always they will all receive their own named host license and be able to basically invite up to 100 people into video meetings. Uh, another license model is called uh, virtual ports, uh, which means that that people buy um, a specific capacity, a specific amount of ports for simulta simultaneous connections into the Bluejeans cloud. And the third option is called corporate access license, which, which really is based on the total amount of employees within a customer. Um, and, and then it's a fixed fee for all of those customers to get their own, own license and use it unlimited, uh, in an unlimited fashion. Um, so this last, last option, corporate access license, really is the, the most affordable if, if you look at it on a per user basis, where we actually go down even below 10 users, uh, 10 euros per user per month. Um, of course, based on, on the total employee uh, amount in that case. So hopefully that answered that question. Thank you. Um, one more question come in. Um, it's, so what's the onboarding process for a reseller to, to sell blue jeans? Also a very good question. So of course, uh, since this is a, a Westcon call, I'm assuming that many of the, of the, the resellers on this call are already Westcon resellers, which uh, makes things easier because uh, 
by being that there's really two steps to, to becoming a Blue Jeans retailer as well. First of all, there's a, a cloud services reseller agreement that Westcon has that needs to be signed, something that your Westcon account manager can help with and send you that documentation. Uh, on top of that, we do have something called the Blue Jeans addendum, this um, cloud reseller services agreement. So those two documents need to be signed for you to have, have the legal rights, if you will, to, to sell, sell Blue Jeans. What happens next once these documents are, are signed is that we then get in touch with you and have a, a full onboarding process in terms of sales training to your sales guys, um, providing you uh, access to collateral and, and marketing information, providing you access to the lead registration program. So, so ability to actually register leads and, and get support from our uh, both pre-sales and sales guys uh, all over Europe. So we have about 40 people in Europe that are there really just to help our resellers win business quicker and help with demo and demos and pricing and, and, and those those types of scenarios. So the way to engage with those are to register a, a lead and then we will automatically within 24 hours contact the reseller to see how we can help in that specific case uh, to, to win the deal. So two documents from Westcon and after that you're in the program and, and we'll help you get started. No, that's a key point. So yeah, the barriers to entry are really low for a reseller. So it's very easy to, to start sending the solution um, with no no upfront investment required whatsoever. Um, another question has come in actually, which is a good question. Um, if an end user has a Polycom a room system, but also a, a room system from another a manufacturer, how does the bridging work? Does, does Bluejet have the capability to bridge any room systems? So yes, we can we can in, in essence bridge any room system. So the whole idea is that the, the meeting organizer sends a Blue Jeans invite, um, and in that invite you have the, the details of how to join a Blue Jeans session. So there's no no point to point calling on Blue Jeans. Uh, there's always only outbound calling from your own network to the Blue Jeans cloud, which also helps in terms of of security. So you don't have to open any inbound ports on your network, but people always. Uh, join based on a BlueJeans invite to the BlueJeans cloud, calling out outbound from their own network. And you can really call from any device that has outbound calling capabilities. You can join a BlueJeans session. Okay, thank you. I think it's also important to um, just highlight the fact that it is possible for end users to trial BlueJeans uh, for 30 days free of charge, which is a great way of uh, seeding um, seeding customers with 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 blue jeans and uh, the weather we've been uh, seeing today is a great use case for for trialing blue jeans and uh, moving meetings to, to to video as opposed to face to face um to, con to ensure business continuity um so right. any more questions no more questions you said no no more, no more questions have come in no okay well i guess we'll just have, have you nick for, for a few few ending words here before we we stop this session and and of course this has been recorded so we can also share this with with you guys who joined the, the call and and send it out to other people who have registered but didn't have the chance to join today yeah no thank you thank you Mikhail. and thanks everyone for your time today so i think hopefully you've, you've learned today that you know, it is a fantastic opportunity um, with, with blue jeans and with polycom you now the barriers to entry to one board are, are minimal and westcon and blue jeans and polycom are here to support you uh, and your customers so uh, i'd really start engaging with your westcon account manager today to understand how you can take your next steps to becoming a, a blue jeans and polycom partner um, so the, the recording and the slide deck will be sent out with you later, uh, sent out to you uh, today, as well as the, um, more details about the next steps. Um, but if you've got any more information or more questions that you want to ask, feel free to reach out to the Westcon UC sales team or to me directly or, or to anyone at the Blue Jeans, and we'll be more than happy to help you. So uh, thank you and wish you a good day. Thanks, everybody. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.